The scheduling experience at Florida Poly is continuously updated. In the future, websites and request forms may look different from what you see in the video. The basic functions of the forms are explained in this video. To locate the 25 Live link, go to floridapolytechnique.org and select the My Poly tab at the top of your screen. Scroll down and select the Add a Calendar Event button. If there's ever any issue accessing the portal or link, you can always access the 25 Live website by entering in 25live.collegenet.com forward slash Florida Polytechnic. Click the sign in link and enter in the same credentials you would use when signing into the portal. Once you've signed in, select the Event Wizard tab located at the top of the page. You will start by filling out the event name and event title for your event. The difference between the two is that the event name is used when searching for that particular event and you are only given 40 characters to describe the event. The event title, on the other hand, is 120 characters and is used by the 25 Live Publisher to describe the event in the calendar. Select the correct type for your event. Our test event will be a meeting, so I'll select Meeting. Select the primary organization that the event falls under. We'll select College of Innovation and Technology. If you frequently use the same organization, you can star it and it will populate in the future under your starred organizations. Next, select the headcount. How many people you expect to show up for the event? This ultimately will affect which locations that will populate in the wizard, so please give an accurate number. If you're setting up a one-time event, select the box marked, no, this event only has one occurrence. If the event has multiple days, select Yes, this event has more than one occurrence. We'll select more than one occurrence. Choose the date and time of the event. Next, choose how this event repeats. We'll select Weekly. Complete the form as it applies to your meeting. Choose Weekly and which day it would repeat on. Add any needed comments on the bottom to describe your schedule. Search the location by name or enter the room number desired. If you're unsure of the name or the room number, you can also enter the building you'd like to hold your meeting in and it will populate all the available room in that building. Star the location if you plan on scheduling future meetings in the same room. You are currently limited on resources because the rooms are already provided with most of the necessary technology. However, if you have any special requests for equipment, please contact the help desk at helpdesk at flpoly.org. So for now, we'll skip this step. Upload an image for your event to be published or add a URL link to a website that provides more details. Select the scheduler that will approve this event. The scheduler should be the assistant administrator associated with your department and the requester will be you. Select this option to have the event published to the live calendar. Add any additional comments for this event. Agree to the affirmation and select save. You can now view, edit, or email your event, and we recommend emailing your approver the event. And if you have any other questions, please contact the help desk by phone at 863-874-8888. Or you can email us at helpdesk at flpoly.org.